Hi, Kongan family. My name is Curtis Goble, and welcome to this week's Kongan Snippet. In 1983, there was a 61-year-old man who showed up for Australia's most grueling endurance race. Australia has this running race that is 543 miles long. 543 miles. And it usually takes five days to complete it. And they get all of these endurance racers there. And all of these guys, I mean, that is brutal. I could barely do that in my car. <laughs> and these guys are running it on foot. So, 1983, they're getting ready to race. And this old 61-year-old man shows up and he's in overalls and he's got rubber glue, rubber gloshes, these rubber boots on, okay? And he, he's lined up and they go, who is this guy? What is he? He really thinks he's going to run? And so they look at him. Gun goes off. Pew! Everyone takes off, including the 61-year-old man. They all look at him and they start to make fun of him because he wasn't even running. What he was doing, he was doing this shuffle. He was like, whoosh, 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 whoosh. so he wasn't even picking up his legs very hard. And he was just running. So all these runners, boom, boom, yeah, look at me, I'm doing great. You know, they finish 100 miles, they go to bed, they wake up, do another 100 miles, yeah. The first guy that came in after five days goes, woohoo, I, you know, I won. They go, no, you actually took second place. They go, what? How did I take second place? <laughs> they go, you know the old farmer dude right there in the galoshes and the overalls? Uh, he just broke the record by a day and a half. How is that possible? They get on the stand. He, this guy right here gets up on the stand, first place. They give him a trophy, and they hand him an envelope. And he goes, what's this? And they go, well, it's your winning prize. You get $10,000. He goes, I get $10,000? <laughs> they says, yeah, that's, that's the first place prize for winning this race. He goes, well, I didn't even know. So they start, ask, they start talking to him. His name is Cliff Young. He's a farmer in Australia. And they go, how in the world did you do this? He goes, well, I have 2,000 acres. 2,000 acres, and on my farm, I have sheep. 2,000 sheep. And when the big storm starts coming in, guess what? I have to go get them. So he gets up, and he says, I just start running. He goes, I have no one else to help me. So I just start, I just start running. I just start shuffling. And he rounds up all the sheep. And he goes, sometimes it takes me a day, day and a half. Sometimes it takes me four or five days to get them all, but I got to get them all in before this big race, before this big, before this big storm comes in. And they go, that is amazing. And they go, did you sleep? He goes, no, I didn't sleep. Am I supposed to sleep? And they go, well, I guess you don't have to. So he never sleep because no one ever told him. He just kept racing because he didn't know any better. And everyone was making fun of him because he never ran. He actually did a shuffle. He is now famous. Long distance marathon runners copy what he did and they call it the Cliff Young Shuffle. <laughs> In Enagic, my suggestion is just shuffle along. Don't stop. Just keep going. Don't give up. You don't have to go fast. You can just do it at your own pace. And trust me, it will eventually pay off. My name is Curtis Goble and thank you so much for joining me in this week's Kongan Snippet. <laughs>